Leet was my only lead to discovering Graham's connection to the stalker. And the obsolete map reference E1594 was the only lead I had to finding Leet. As I surveyed the room, I was greeted by a familiar face. Hello, darling! What looked like a mobile toilet brush was fanatically scrubbing the floor. Warning, 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 citizen. Cleaning route is active. Citizen, cleaning route is active. All citizens, a happy aspiration day. Oh, who saved us from starving in sadness and hate? Savior Joey, put clothes on our backs and food on our plates. Savior Joey. Who made Union City the best thing for miles? Savior Joey makes everything nice and has nothing but smiles. Savior Joey. Savior Joey. Savior Joey. Savior Joey. Greetings, citizen. We are the Council, your democratically elected representatives. Five years ago, Savior Joey decreed that we take charge of our own destiny and prove ourselves worthy of the freedom that he brought. The Council proudly serves to uphold his legacy for the benefit of all citizens of the greatest city in the world. I am the Minister for Safety. I preserve the peace to keep you safe, to make you happy. I am the Minister for Comfort. I ensure the city is clean and all amenities work for your comfort, to make you happy. I am the Minister of Plenty. I ensure that you want for nothing, at your kudos level of course, to make you happy. I am the Minister for Wellbeing. I nourish your mental health, to make you happy. I am the Minister of Aspiration. I help you set and achieve the very highest personal goals to make you happy. Farewell, citizen. May all your days be happy. We invite you to salute the people of Asio City, our faraway friends and valued members of the Union Group. Unstinting and determined cooperation has allowed both cities to grow to become the richest cities in the world. We stand together, refuting the fake news spread by Hobart in their attempt to undermine our unity. 
Join us in celebrating our commonwealth of kindred spirits, united by bonds of friendship. Union City wishes all citizens a happy aspiration day. Aspiration brooch required to access to access to exhibit. I needed a special aspiration brooch to get access to the room. After bringing an end to the tyranny of the oppressor Link, Joey created Minos to ensure that forthwith technology would always serve rather than enslave the citizens. Minos is devoted to ensuring your happiness. Always there for you. Minos is available for you on any terminal. It knows you. It understands you. It helps you become everything you aspire to be. Minos. Built by machines. Inspired by humans. The centerpiece of the whole museum was a synthetic arm. I recognized it. It was Joey's. He'd lost it in our fight against Link all those years ago. <gasps> look, 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 over here. Dad, do you have to be so loud? The arm! Isn't it amazing? Seemed like I wasn't the only one Sassy. interested in the Joey arm. Didn't I promise? Didn't I say I'd bring you here? You did, Dad. I'm so stoked. This is Joey's arm! This was once attached to the really real Joey! Savior of Union City! <sighs> Aren't you feeling blessed to be here? Of course I am, Dad, but... Then tell the world! How awesome is this place, huh? It's awesome. It's what? This place is awesome! Say it again! I said, it's awesome! Yes! Now you've got it! I'm just gonna have a look around. Seriously? It's Joey's arm! Why would you want to look at anything else? Safety. Commeration day to show your gratitude and dare to dream what you might become. Union City wishes all citizens a happy aspiration day. Here begins the story of Joey. Ten years ago, evil gripped our beloved city. The people suffered under the tyranny of the oppressor Link. Their voices cried out for help. From deep in the gap, Savior Joey heard their pleas and came to free us all. Citizens a happy aspiration day. The struggle against Link was long and fierce, and there was great suffering. Only through great sacrifice did the Savior defeat oppressor Link and declare the city free. But his work had only just begun. Triumphant, he rose from the depths to guide us to a glorious future. A happy aspiration day. Savior Joey leashed the oppressor Link to serve and protect the people and founded the council to restore the rule of democracy. Then, his work complete, he departed the city to spread his wisdom to the savage peoples of the world. It's a happy aspiration day. The droid was going around in a circle, repeating the same inane message. It was a hologram of Danielle Piermont, a friend from when I last came to Union City. I want to check out the old history exhibit. Union a City special collection of artifacts. Alert. Trajectory obstructed. Hello?
Hello there. Good day, friend. Are you here to walk with Joey? I've walked with Joey before. He had treads at the time. Yes. When you tread with Joey, you become one with happiness. How do you walk with an arm? You don't walk walk with him. You walk with him in here. I think you're probably walking with him up there. Oh, the mind's always on Joey, that's for sure. Is that girl your daughter? She is indeed. My precious Cecily. We're a big, happy, Joey-loving family. Ah, oh, that's nice. Is it a large family? Oh no, since my wife left, it's just me and Cecily. Oh, I'm sorry. She ran off with some rich industrialist. Wore a nice coat, though. I forgive him, of course, but I'm not sure that our savior could ever do the same. You kind of worship Joey, huh? Is that why you're here? Well, I mean, yes, but not just that. I'm looking for a sign. A sign? From who? Joey, of course. When a man reaches our age... Our age? He starts to look for... guidance. And what better thing to point me in the right direction than the arm of Joey himself? Joey's actual arm? Quite something, huh? Yes. The original arm that wrenched the city from the precipice of damnation. Didn't it just get stuck to a hand scanner? This very arm wielded a weapon so great it tore down a tyranny. This very arm wielded a weapon so great it toppled the heads of government. Forged a plowshare and rebuilt the city from the ground up. With this arm, he plucked the eyes from the Hydra of Link and gave them to the people so we all might see. All that by himself? Yes! Yes! All by himself! The whole story can be found on the stations around the hall. Can I ask you a little more about Joey? Our savior. I knew Joey since before he was a savior. Everything you ever wanted to know about Joey, from the beginning of time, is in this very room. And if you want to know about before the beginning of time, I suggest the Museum of Old History. Not for the faint-hearted, though. It is pretty shocking to see what Joey saved us from. Need one of these aspiration brooches, though, of course. Is that a social climber aspiration brooch? Ah, I know a real savior craver when I see one. I'm proud to be one of the biggest social climbers in the past 30 days. And the 30 days before that. Such an honor. Sorry, I made you drag that out of me a bit. I'm just never sure where Joey stands on humility. Oh, I say he's rather flexible. If I wanted to get inside the old history exhibit, this brooch would be the key. How can I get one of those brooches? Just be a good citizen. Every morning, every afternoon, every evening, and all night long. And then wake up and do it again tomorrow. I'm not sure I have time for that. Could you give me your aspiration brooch? I couldn't. They're issued specifically to social climbers. Could you lend me yours? Uh, no can do. Only the highest Kudos social climbers are allowed into the old history exhibit. You are not worthy. According to the council, that is. So that's your daughter, huh? She is indeed. My precious Cecily. What sort of sign are you looking for? At this point, anything. I've been such a devoted citizen, putting Joey first above everything. My job, my wife and daughter, all second to Joey, just as he would have wanted. But now, I worry I'm straying off the path. Ever thought about a counselor? But who would deliver better counsel than the savior himself? Say, I'm looking for a specific location. An obsolete area code E1594. Is there a map around here somewhere? A map around here? I don't think so. Unless you mean the map in the old history exhibit. Well, that counts. Well, in that case, you're in luck. There is one in the old history exhibit. How it was before the Joey era. It's like staring into oblivion. But of course, without a brooch, they won't let you in. There's a map of the city in the old history exhibit? Not just any map. 
It shows the city as it was ten years ago. There's a map of the city. You betcha. What are you hoping to learn from the arm? The next step to take to a bright future. My vocation, my journey, destiny. And I'm nearly there. I've never seen the arm act so erratically until today. And what if you don't like what it has to say? Who am I to judge the will of Joey? This guy wasn't going anywhere without a sign from Joey. I had a feeling, without my intervention, he'd be waiting a while. I better go and admire something. Happy Aspiration Day! Now, if you might stand aside so the Savior and I can have a little us time. Just me and the hand. Excuse me. Oh, hey. Wow, you look... different. What do you mean? Your outfit. It's so... Iconic? I was just gonna say weird. If mine's weird, what color is yours supposed to be? Duh. It's perinicle mangerine. It's like... Tuesday's happiest color. Where are you even from? You'd never believe me. This museum visit just got way more interesting. Your father seems to really love this place. He'd spend all day, every day here if he could. That's some real faith he must have. That's one word for it. He keeps going on about a sign. As if Joey's arm is gonna tell him how to be normal. I'm sensing some resentment. Maybe he should ask it how to win Mom back. Are there many people like your father in the city? Like my father? What, you mean Joey fanatics? They have a club. But my dad is... something else. Got enough faith for the two of us. Maybe even enough for all three of us. You have no idea. Is there more to this museum? There's the whole old history section. About what Union City was like before Savior Joey came along. Oh, really? I'd like to learn more about that story. I've heard it's pretty depressing. They only let you in if they think you can handle it. How do they determine that? The same way they determine everything else. Kudos. Like, if your kudos is high enough, or in my dad's case, raised enough since last month, they figure you've got the moral fiber to be able to make it out the other side still smiling. Praise Joey, am I right? So, uh, where did you first find Joey? Scattered across an irradiated gap scrap heap. Yourself? Uh, in my heart? Your answer is way better. Praise Joey! Em so, Sca uh, in my heart? Your answer is way- So there's a map in the old history exhibit showing the city as it was? Yes, and it's old. Everything in there is- I'll be darned if that isn't an aspiration brooch. Great! Another social climber! You should speak to my dad. You don't sound too proud of your achievement. What, me? No, it's my dad who earned the kudos, obviously. Talk to him if you want to know who to impress. Then, how did you get yours? Oh, dad got a second one. Bring a friend or something. So they're transferable? Technically, yes. Hey, listen, I know we just met, but I really was hoping to get one of those brooches. Need to check out the old history exhibit. Let me guess. You were hoping I'd give you mine. That's right. No offense, but you don't seem as... evangelical as most Joey freaks. What's back there that's so important to you? Do you ever feel like you're not being given the whole truth about the city? You mean, how perfect everything is? Yeah. Sometimes it does seem a bit... If I were a cynic, I might call some of it a little... unbelievable? Don't say that around my dad. He really buys into all this stuff. Hey, listen. You and me, we're on the same wavelength here. And it's a different wavelength than my father. He does seem very devout. Right? And honestly, just... Staring at an old arm gets dull. You can just walk out, but I'm stuck here. And you can just go into the back while I can't. 
I'll make a deal with you. You give my dad a reason to leave, and I'll give you this dumb thing. You in? Okay, I'm in. That brooch in exchange for your freedom. Finally. Praise Joey. Praise? Yes, praise Joey. The girl had agreed to give me her aspiration brooch if I could somehow get her father to leave the museum. To show your gratitude. The guy was looking for a sign from the Joey arm. I wondered if I could help. Union City wishes all citizens a happy aspiration day. Union City wishes all citizens a happy aspiration day. Vandalizing the museum's centerpiece would have been a surefire way to blow my cover. The aspiration day, the fake news spread by Hobart in their attempt to undermine our unity. Union City wishes all citizens a happy aspiration. Is all citizen Union City is now After all that I did to maximize my kudos, why have you forsaken me? I worked so hard. I did every... That's okay, Dad. It's all all right. But Cecily... I just don't understand. Come on now, Dad. Let's go get you a nice can of Spankles at the cafe. Yes. Yes, I think that'll do the trick. I think it's time I tried that new flavor. I very much enjoyed our talk today, Mystery Man. It's been... eye-opening. I'm glad we could reach an arrangement, miss. Featherbottom. Cecily Featherbottom. Best aspiration day ever. Here you go. A deal's a deal. Until we meet again, may the light and wisdom of Savior Joey smile upon you. Happy Aspiration Day. Union City wishes all the guy was looking for a sign from the Joey arm. I wondered if I could help. Welcome to the old history exhibit, young lady. The information droid will be with you shortly. Meet Spunky, lifelong friend and companion of our benefactor, Danielle Piermont. Spunky was a friend to all low-life citizens and a true symbol of Union City spirit until he was found drowned in a pond at the tender age of seven. Through this exhibit, may his bark be with us always. The robot was a repository of information about all the exhibits. Many years ago, Spunky had helped me in my quest to defeat Link. I was glad to see that he had gotten the respect he deserved. 
Excuse me. Oi! Keep the noise down. Oh, sorry. A little respect while you're in this hallowed place. Right. And you're a guard here? Name's Payne. Roy Allen Payne. Ex-security officer, 30 years on the force. And I've got my eyes on you. What exactly is this exhibit? What is the exhibit, he asks. Joey, give me strength. This is the old history exhibit. The definitive collection of Union City artifacts. Courtesy of our illustrious benefactor, Mrs. Piermont herself. It just looks like a load of old junk from the old regime. Junk? No. Old regime? Yes. In the days before our savior took control. What sort of things are inside this exhibit? Just take a look around. Relics. Relics of a bygone era. We got tech in here over five years old. And does it all still work? Most of it should. Say what you like about the old regime, but stuff was made to last. Are you the only person working here? The only person? Yes. Not thinking of trying something funny, are we, son? Absolutely not. Jolly good. Because I don't think funny is funny. I don't doubt it. And the robots that work for me, they don't like funny either. They work for you? Well, not for me. Technically, I suppose they're my co-workers. Does this museum really need security? There's always something going on beneath the veil. Oh yeah? Like what? Let's just say I'm no stranger to vandals, thieves, enemy agents. And you can handle those? Hmm. Well, it is down to me to supervise the exhibit of old history, including but not limited to the security of the displays and artifacts. I heard that you have an old map of the city in here. Did you now? And what precisely did you hear? That it shows Union City as it was ten years ago. See, I have an obsolete area code, E1594, and I need to see where it is. Hmm, I see. Well, the map table is just over in the center of the room. But a specific area code, that'd be like finding a needle in a haystack. Good luck, son. See you later. Enjoy the exhibits. Quietly. The information droid will be with you shortly. This old city refrigeration unit is one of the last known relics of the great gastroenteritis crisis. A particularly dark piece of pre-Joey history. Its seal remains unbroken to preserve its mysteries and per request of the Ministry of Comfort's janitorial staff. Protect your family with Spankles, the only food replacement guaranteed to be irradiated for your safety and drinking pleasure. It was an old fridge. There were strange noises coming from it, as if something was trapped inside. A padlock prevented whatever was inside from getting out. What? Who? Me? Yeah, you! I was, um, just giving the machine a checkup. Good luck with that. Lost calls if I ever saw one. Meanwhile, why don't you get back to enjoying the exhibit? Quietly. That's why you're here, isn't it? Oh, absolutely. I just can't get enough of old history. The information droid will be with you shortly. Public music in Union City used to be restricted to low-life areas only. At one of our long-lost clubs, the St. James Club, citizens could meet to dance and drink. 
These days, music devices are mostly personalized, and loud music is only permitted in VIP areas or public stages. This city synth garbage would never compete with the stuff back in the Gap. The information droid will be with you shortly. Life in the Gap has always been primitive. Here we see a typical scene of two fully grown Gaplanders eking out an existence in the harsh wastes of the desert. Note the animal they are about to slaughter, most likely the now extinct quadruped commonly known as a goat. Goats were fierce predators, which were notoriously difficult to trap. Our two models here were clearly top hunters. These models were far too clean cut to be Gaplanders. They'd done a good job with the goat, though. Union City still had some pretty backward views on the Gap. An old barrel transporter robot. Those robots always gave me the creeps. The information droid will be with you shortly. Just 10 years ago, this lumbering barrel transporter robot was the height of technological sophistication. Designed to carry anything, provided that it fit into a barrel, these primitive robots paved the way for the Savior's arrival. The information droid will be with you shortly. This antique map shows the primitive transportation available prior to the installation of the monopod system. Unlike today, travelers often risk delays, confusing journey plans, and the inconvenience of inconsequential chatter. Now, work is just a button press away. What lies beneath Union City? Some talk of giant monsters, tentacle creatures, illicit android laboratories. Beware, spreading these unpatriotic rumors can have serious implications for your kudos rating. Ten years ago, I'd used the old underground system to reach the heart of Link. The gruesome tendrils pulsed ominously. The product of Link, an experimental fusion of man with computer that had ended in tyranny. The information droid will be with you shortly. This organism found in the depths of the old city remains one of its greatest mysteries. It was at one time theorized that the biomass was the result of a mutated mini knockwurst flushed into the old sewage system. However, numerous court proceedings dictated that this was in fact a false statement fabricated by the franchise's competitor, Lil Knackers. Whilst its origins are unknown, citizens are assured it represents no threat to our well-being and is displayed here merely as a reminder of the dark ages of our great Union City. The scanner looked broken. I doubted I'd be able to use it anytime soon. The Joey Speaks looked like a gimmick, but I couldn't pass the opportunity to hear my old buddy's voice again. The information droid will be with you shortly. These humble scraps of primitive circuitry house the spark that would become our beloved savior, Joey. Many disciples of the Savior hold this board up as an example of immaculate assembly with rather less than immaculate soldiering. Notice, 
This attraction is currently closed after complaints of language of a most unsavior-like nature. The old link terminal had long since stopped working. The information droid will be with you. La, la, la. La, 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 la. Joey? La, la, la. La, 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 la. Joey, it's me, Foster. Foster? It is really you. Hey, old buddy. Boy, am I glad to see... Let's talk more crowbar, Foster. Or whatever other great idea you have for getting me out of here. Is that... Joey? Joey, I'm so sorry. I had no idea what they'd done to you. Yeah, yeah. Save your apologies for after you've got me out of this. Everybody, it's an Aspiration Day miracle. Joey's speaking to us. No, that's not Joey. No way. Joey, it's really you? Oh, great. Here we go again. Joey. The information droid will Link be with you shortly. Link was Union City's original digital curation device. Through terminals such as these, Link was used to control all aspects of citizens' lives. Their tyranny was ended when Savior Joey arrived and took control of the city. Joey replaced Link with our venerated Minos system, dedicated to creating the best city possible in which all citizens can be happy. I'd had a run-in with this tech all those years ago. I hoped Union City had gone in a more sustainable direction. The information droid will be with you shortly. To power our glorious city, we used to use dangerous fuels. These days, we burn our waste and use that to provide all the power our citizens will ever need. A giant holographic map of Union City, as it was 10 years ago. If I could get the map to display area E1594, I would find the building where I suspected Graham had met with Leet. A metal panel was bolted onto the side of the table. A metal panel was bolted onto the side of the table. The information droid will be with you shortly. This holographic map demonstrates the success of the Council in revitalizing Union City according to Joey's guidance. With new Council-approved technology, every citizen can finally look up and see clear blue skies. The information droid will be with you shortly.
exit in an orderly manner. The exhibit was on vermin-prompted lockdown. I had to find a way out without being detected, but not before figuring out where this leak guy was hiding out, not to mention rescuing Joey. It was Joey's original circuit board, the one that I had built myself as a child. I'd recognize my own soldering anywhere. I got you, buddy. I'd built the circuit board when I was just a kid, and now I had it back. But it was more than just a board. My old pal Joey was on it. unplugged for a moment. Everything I ever loved is dead. Oh, hey, Foster. You're here too, huh? <sighs> Welcome back, Joey. Is this the best shell you could find? It was just collecting dust. You've turned me into a vacuum cleaner, Foster. Again! It's functional. Don't be ungrateful. And look, someone gave you a cool beanie. Don't patronize me, Foster. We'll find you a better shell soon, I promise. Good, because this one sucks. And not even efficiently. Listen, we're in deep trouble. There's something new. Care to bring me up to speed? I learned about somebody called Leet here in the city. I think he's somehow connected to the kidnapping. And we're gonna go find him? That's right. I came here to find out where he hides out. And to rescue me? Come on, Joey. That goes without saying. What are the capabilities of your current shell? It's a vacuum bot, Foster. It sucks and it blows. End of. Don't all these old vacuums have an interface probe? I was really hoping you'd forgotten that part. Don't be ashamed. It might come in handy. I'm not ashamed. It's just cold in here. If anyone asks, my name is Graham Grundy. You come up with that yourself? No. I needed an ID to get inside the city. I got this one from a dead body. Jeez, Foster. Was it dead when you found it? Don't worry, Joey. My conscience is clear. I came here looking for a missing child, Milo. He was kidnapped from my village. Oh no, Rob. That's terrible. You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? Don't look at me. I've been trapped in that glass prison for years. That's everything. Great to have you back, Joey. The Gap Chaps are back! We were never called that. Best friends? That'll do, Joey. That'll do. The panel had been covering the table's interface port. An antiquated interface port was built into the side of the table. You see that holographic map? You need to get your eyesight checked, Foster. It's not showing a map anymore. Union City is smaller than I thought. What's the scale on this thing? Hey, Joey. Got a job for you. What is it? Remember that leak guy I mentioned? I never forget a thing. Well, I've tracked him to an area code, E1594. Thing is, that code is part of the old system. It's obsolete. Cut to it, Foster. This old map shows the city as it was 10 years ago. The old system. If I can find E1594 on here, it would show me where to find Leet. Have you seen the size of this thing? That will take you hours. Exactly. I need you to plug yourself in. 
I bet you'll find the location in no time. <sighs> Give me a moment. Here, Foster. E-1594. Joey, you're a genius. There. That's the building I'm looking for. It's on the industrial level. Home Crescent Recycling Center. This is where your guy Lee is? I can't be sure, but it's the best lead I've got. Okay, Foster. What's the plan now? We need to get to that recycling center. But first, we need to break out of here without being seen. Break out. Find lead. Got it. Doors were on lockdown. I wondered whether Joey could help me break out. Hey, Joey. We need to figure a way out of here. What do you mean? We can't just walk out, not with the museum on high alert. That's right. A priceless artifact has been stolen. Really, Joey? Priceless? You can't put a price on friendship, Foster. Do you think any of this junk could help us out? It wouldn't be the first time. Can you help us escape, Joey? I don't know. This old tin soldier might have a few tricks up its sleeve. You got a welder in that thing? Better. My probe. How's the shell, Joey? It's old, cranky, and it itches. Suck it up, Joey. You have a nice day too, Foster. Any chance we could hook your board up to the vermin robot? That vermin robot is entirely Minos technology. Is there a big difference? Well, you know how when you plug me into a port, there's a right side up and an upside down way? They changed the ports in Minos so you can plug it in either way. Revolutionary. Yeah, but it does mean you can't just plug your headphones in anymore. What were you doing in that exhibit, Joey? I was on a journey of self-reflection. Really? What did you learn? I counted 2,147,483,647 sheep. Careful, Joey. You'll max out your memory. What was the Joey Speaks exhibit about, anyway? What do you think? People came from across the city to hear my wisdom. And what did you tell them? We are all living in a simulation, and death is the only escape. And then what? I don't know. I was switched off before I got to the noose part. Anything here you'd like to plug into? What do you mean, Foster? That probe of yours. It might be our only way out of here. Listen, if you find something useful, I'll maybe consider giving it the old Joey one, too. That shell suits you, Joey. Get lost. Wait, find me a new shell. Then get lost. Only if it shuts you up. Hey, Joey, can you talk to the transporter robot? What do you mean, talk? I already said... You probe, Joey. Probe the robot. Go probe yourself, Foster. If you could give the transporter just enough juice... Please, let's not call it juice. Whatever. Just see if you can get it started. Okay, but would you mind looking the other way? Of course. Done? Don't look. Sorry. It's uh, not doing anything. You don't say, Foster. It's been wiped clean, decommissioned, murdered. We need to give it new protocols. Do you think you could do that? Of course I could. I just need to know how the system works first. I'll have another look around. Try giving this a look, Joey. I hope you're not wasting my time, Foster. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting.
It's the insides of one of those old barrel robots. Like the one over there? Give me a minute. Let me see if I can do anything with this. Like get us out of here? Sure. If you're lucky, I might even be able to get us out alive. What do you want it to do? Let's get out of here. We need somewhere hidden outside this room. Toilets? Toilets. Try and aim for the men's room, Joey. Whatever. You almost done? Don't look! Sorry. And that's done. Let's never speak of this again. So what now? Well, are you ready to go? Ready. Then climb aboard and let's go! was just large enough to squeeze into. It was a snug fit, it smelled bad, and I felt stupid. to escape unseen. Don't make me clean up in there, Foster. Come on, Foster. Let's get a move on. Warning, sit. Warning, citizen. Clean. Warning, sit. Mr. Grundy? Mr. Grundy? It is Mr. Grundy, isn't it? Uh, of course, Mentor Alonzo. Who else would I be? Well, quite, Mr. Grundy. Who indeed, hmm? What brings you down to the Museum of New History today? On Aspiration Day? Where else would I want to be? Oh, perhaps at home, preparing for the party. Oh, my apologies. I had forgotten that you no longer have the required social standing. I wonder, may I scan your U-chip again? I don't understand. What's wrong with my U-chip? Oh, nothing. Nothing, I'm sure. Just a curious little anomaly. Yes, there it is. A sector of corrupt data, almost as if... How very strange. Have no fear. I'll consult my colleagues at the Ministry, and we'll soon have you sorted out. I'm almost positive you have nothing to worry about. Let's hope so. Just one more thing, Mr. Grundy. Yes, Mentor? I am surprised to see you wearing an aspiration brooch. By the power of Joey, I am now a social climber. So it would seem. So it would seem. Alonzo was definitely on to me. I'd have to watch my step around him. Foster. Let's read through my history. I don't think you quite appreciate how incredible I am. Graham had taken the track Bilby to the Home Crescent Recycling Center. I was sure this is where I'd find Leet. I didn't realize I was that big. 